What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're about to go over how to play elite defense in Madden 23. If you're new to the channel or if you're enjoying the content, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button right now for a shout out in the next video. Today we're about to go over how to play elite defense in Madden 23. Let's get right into it. My whole LB, boom, come out here, look for work, and we should have either the cornerback or we should have a disengage. All right, so we're going to be breaking down how to play elite defense in Madden 23, and this is without blitzing, okay? All you have to do, if you don't know the secret, is hold the L1 or the LB button. That right there is going to do two things. Number one, whoever your user is assigned to, he will take off in that direction. That will give you a quick speed burst. Number two, it will mess up the offensive line, okay? Disengages will happen by you holding that LB or that L1 pre-play. Now, I'm gonna show you something. As you can see, the little dots over the top of my user, okay? It's gonna be three little dots. Look at the screen, it's gonna be three dots, it's gonna be four dots. That's gonna let you know the type of resistance is on that player that you over the top of, okay? The type of resistance. As you can see, four bars is over the top of my user right now. So that center has real good resistance built up. Okay, so that's going to help your edges get better one on one because they have three bars or less. Okay, so once the resistance builds up, that's the reason why if you are using abilities, you want to use certain abilities that don't give the guy resistance. So the center has a lot of good resistance, but on the edges, they only have two bars and three bars. That's going to help you get that one on one by pushing that LB or that L1 right before the play i'm holding l1 lb right now you can see the center has four bars he's fully resisted it's going to be hard for you to get through the middle but we are going to get edge pressure without even sending extra people okay right here you can see the offensive lineman is confused the running back is confused i'm going to get somebody free every single time or i'm gonna get a disengage in that first two seconds before my opponent can make a read look at the running back and look at the center both turned around if he runs out there and he gets that guy the other guy is gonna get free who's jumping up right there close to the quarterback holding that lb or that l1 is super glitchy and this is gonna help you become an elite user in madden 23 and also get you them block sheds and get to that quarterback 